thought our team played really well tonight. Uh, very hard. Uh, certainly getting off to the good start uh, was important. Uh, very efficient in the way we played and moved the ball and uh, shared it. Guys uh, shot it well from three. Um, had a little trouble with the zone in the second half. Um, you know, but we still got some, some good looks. Marquise did not have a great second half for us. Um, but I thought our defense was was really good all day. I thought we really competed. I thought we, you know, guarded them about as well as we could guard them. Uh, made it hard on some guys and rebounded pretty well. Handled the ball well against the press. Um, I, just, I just thought we had a, uh, a good plan coming in. And I thought our guys really, really played well today. Right, I think you had... 18 assists on yes. 22 baskets. I mean, what, when you some, some of that's going against when you play against zone, you're going to have more. You should have more assisted baskets. There's more, more times you're leading guys into, uh, into shots because there's not always a man exactly on them. Um, so that's part of it. I just I thought we moved the ball well. I thought we we got some of those against the press where I thought we got it up the floor and got it to the middle and got it reversed and made some plays that way. So. Um, you know, this was a this was a good game for us in terms of our passing and and certainly making shots. You know, we don't always when we make ten threes a game, we're uh, really good. But that's probably about the sixth game this year, fifth game this year that we've done it. So we, we need to be able to make a few more shots. What, uh, what do you feel like, Brad, that you learned about fit in the, in the first matchup that you were able to uh, to to sort of successfully implement or use against of this one? Um, just, I think we were a little more comfortable with the press. Um, just, you know, the first time you see it, you're trying to figure it out a little bit more. What is it exactly? What are they trying to do? Kind of watch it on film. It, it sometimes it changes a little bit. Um, but and then the other thing is just how hard they play. I think they play really hard. Uh, Jeff does a great job of getting these young guys to compete at that that level. Um, he's playing young players, and you know, they're athletic. They don't they don't look like freshmen out there physically very many of them um, and then they they come at you they really come at you physically and you know obviously we're familiar with Trey and and uh, Xavier's outstanding in terms of his confidence level and how aggressive he is and you know uh, Tony's another guy down in our area that, that you know we're aware of and so we know how athletic he is and I just think you, you know you respect how hard they play the kids play really hard what was your level of concern during Pitt's little run there in second half? Yeah, obviously you're always concerned. Um, you know, we were battling some fouls in the first half. We had a couple guys over there with two and one with three, and a couple of them were in similar positions. So you're, there's one time we had a bunch of guys out there that, to be honest with you, they don't know a lot of – couldn't call very much because they don't know um, the, all the positions that they were in. Two guys were, like, in different positions, and we're playing with four guards and – so there was some trouble there, um, but you know you know that they're going to make a run, and you know some things are, you know, you're not going to shoot it probably as well as you did in the first half, and you just got to hope that your defense is solid, that you rebound it well, and and you don't turn the ball over for points, which I don't think we did much, maybe once um, in the game. There was a little you know, bodies on the floor, there were balls getting thrown out of bounds, but you guys are you guys sort of comfortable? If it's not maybe the most aesthetically pleasing. I mean, I think we, I think we try to play hard. I think we're a pretty good defensive team. We don't try to, you know, try to keep people out as much rhythm as we can. Um, you know, we're not dynamic scoring, and so it's hard for us to score 80 points in a game. And so, if we get in games like that, it's probably not very good for us. Um, but at the same time, you know, when there are open court situations, we're gonna, we're gonna go play. And I think you saw some of that today too. Um, but I think. You know, those you, you saw two teams that play really hard, very physical, and kids that really go after. It. And uh, you know, again, we had guys diving on the floor. They had guys diving on the floor. We had guys taking charges. They had guys taking charges. You know, some were blocks, some were charges. It, it, you know, it was hard to get to the rim cleanly, and uh, that's because both teams are you know well positioned, well set up, and the kids are playing hard. How has Marquise Reed grown as a player for you since you got him from Robert Morris You know, um, physically he's much stronger and bigger. Um, he's not a big, strong guy by any stretch, but he is physically more talented and, and able to handle more contact and make more plays. Um, you know, his confidence is very high. Uh, 
uh, right now as a senior. And then uh, I think his all-around game, is, his passing has improved. Um, you know, he, he's, he's a guy who wants to score points, but in situations when you bring two to the ball on him, you know, he, he can recognize who to throw it to, whether it's a penetrating kick or whether it's a ball screen and he hits, hits roll guys or, you know, a corner guy or something. He's really improved in all that over the last couple of years. Any more questions?